dear man, from the beginning of time, I fought against your innocence. So the fact that you keep falling into the same sins that you've been trying to avoid is no coincidence of the sign demon. To rigorously study each and every one of you since birth so we know what your weakness is, our strength is made perfect in your weaknesses now. Before I go any further, I want you to understand that I hate you. But the main point of me having this conversation is to show you how much I appreciate you. So, so thank you, because your generation has generated so much hope for me. It's pathetic, yet impressive. So, so please uh, continue with your carelessness. See, you don't even have to worship me because I am the only being that you could make your God without even being aware of it. So by default, I win. If it's not in him, it's not even a contest, because when you don't serve the God that's right, I'm the only God that's left. Therefore, there's no need to discriminate. I've even come to eliminate him. He. Her, she's kisses from me are sweeter than pieces of chocolate droplets. So, Adam, Eve, take and eat. Your disobedience is so sexy to me. And I have a fetish for hypocrites the way you go from right to wrong, from light to dark, that turns me on like a switch, cause you switch when you walk, so justify him, man. Justify sins you're already condemned, and just allow me to cause you to pass the rock of your salvation, which brings deliverance to your soul. Now, you can never blame me, see, I just gave you an assist. You took yourself to the hole, see, every day. I replicate a reversed Halloween. My potential costumes are made of flesh and blood. With a spirit that is breathed and a will that is free, I see billions of costumes now. Hmm. Who should I be? How about the perfect guy you'd like to meet? Kind of rough, but kind of sweet with a pair of hurricane eyes that'll shatter the levees of your heart and sweep you off your feet. But instead of a ring, I'll just hand you a leash and treat you like the female dog that you are to me. Or I can come in a miniskirt with heels because I know you like this, guys. But sometimes that is my disguise. I'm a terrorist of the eyes, the way I hijack your mind and make you blind to what's right. I have you so enticed that you might just cheat on your wife or better yet die for me. Because when you put truth under this bed, you'll always lie with me. No lie. In the end, nobody wins. That's why we end up with our souls tied. See, I have used mankind to become the greatest diversion that mankind has ever seen. Because I never look like the problem when I make the problem look like human beings. See, if sisters have strife with sisters and brothers, could fight their brothers. I have the victory, because you end up with nations of wounded families, but an unscarred enemy, and it tickles me, because I patented segregation. So the separation of the brethren is just an extension of that invention. So no matter how many children are born into God's kingdom, I make sure they all see section sometimes. Things are not always as bad as they seem. I want you to pretend that hell is like a, a beautiful dream, like, like a blind date with darkness, because love won't be seen, but you will be constantly embraced by undying flames till excruciating pain will seem like relief. But, but wait, no, 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 wait. There's been a glitch in my plans that some of you may call grace. Because despite my 
flowery displays of affection, my showering with bouquets of temptations. How come when one rose, everything changed? It was that Christ. That Christ over 2,000 years ago, I manipulated and perverted men to capture that innocent lamb to torture and murder him because I knew that once the only hope of humanity was dead, I would wear upon my head the glory of omnipotence as my crown for I, ruler of darkness, prince of the air could only rise when the sun was down, but he, he, he flipped the script on me. The very thing I was trying to use to bind you forever, he turned around and used it to set you free. It's like they MC hammered those nails in his wrist. I'm disgusted because the blood that covers believers is too legit. So when you commit your spirit scream, can't touch this, he, 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 he. he. He is a reckless romantic. He will put his entire kingdom on hold to hold you. Why would an impeccable God be so desperate to make a flawed and broken creature whole? You don't even have the slightest clue how much he adores you. That's why, that's why I'm deceiving men and distracting them from seeing him. Yes, I'm always planning to bring calamity so I could magic trick you into thinking that he vanished, but no matter what happens, he always finds a way to breathe a peace on you that passeth my understanding. Of course, your Lord has already conquered me. Why do you think these weapons I formed against you are not prospering? I, I, I am dead meat. That's why I have beef with you. You that believe, and you know he's crushing my head, but I barely bruised his feet so day and night. I approach his throne with accusations of you, but despite my efforts, he never sees you as trash, but instead, as a treasure, he has made his grace so environmentally friendly. The way he embraces humans with his arms shaped like blue bins is beyond stupid. It's, it's unusual, despite how filthy and damaged you are, he still desires to recycle, AKA renew you to use you again, his heart. His heart, his heart is like an internet address bar. He's constantly conducting worldwide searches for lives that will allow him to clear their history and give them new sights for they are spiritually blind, but I've had enough. Because it's completely irrational, it just doesn't make sense why he loves you so much, why? Does he long for your arrival like a child does December 25th? You tread upon his mercy with an attitude like the Scrooge, but he sits and lets it pass, and yet is willing to take you back like the ghost of Christmas past is foolish. But I'm running out of time. This clock is like a bomb. It's tick, tick, ticking away, and those of you that don't watch it will watch it blow up in their face. Now brisk are the movements of my feet. I don't play research, the synonym of insomnia. I can replace it with my name. I'm awake and I work and I work and I go with no brakes. Said I go with no brakes. Plus I'm drunk with road rage. And the only thing that stands in my way is this dead end route called hell. So let's crash and burn together. Forever, please, I beg you, don't surrender to him. Though he said, I have life, if you spell devil backwards, at least you have lived. I would give you the world in exchange for your soul. So please, satisfy my soul's need 
If the sky were the limits for your souls, I would reach, but thank you, oh God, that my sky has a ceiling called the soles of your feet.